All right. All right. So this is not really a huge trailer for everybody else, but it's a giant trailer for me personally. Uh, House of the Dead 1 is easily one of my favorite games of all time. I have a damn arcade machine for it downstairs. You've almost memorized the whole game. I've almost, I, yeah, practically. This was the game I played alongside Marvel vs. Capcom 1. Right. When Marvel 1 was so busy, <laughs> I like mastered House yeah, of the so, Dead. Yeah, I remember you saying you would, you would just like, I play this while I wait while for my I quarter. Wait for my turn. <laughs> and I would beat the, the game. Machine. I would literally beat the game and then and then play this. So House of the Dead is being remade on Nintendo Switch. We haven't seen a trailer for this game in a year. It was in like a montage like a year ago. And yeah. Like, and it just was like there for like 20 it was seconds. A, it was a super brief showing. We actually yeah. don't know how the game is going to function. Like how gyro aiming is going to work. Yeah. We, don't, we didn't know any of that stuff. And uh, finally, right, we see something more on it. House of the Dead 1 has never had an arcade port to a uh, home console. There's no. been a PC version, it's which PC. is a port. There's a weird Saturn port. Yeah. And that's literally it. They never, there's never been an arcade perfect version of House of the Dead 1. So this is like the next closest thing we're going to get. And it looks substantially different from the previous trailer. So uh, I think the quality is on low. Let me crank it. Please help. Everyone's getting killed. <laughs> Crush the frog. Whoa, holy, holy shit. Okay, yeah. It's definitely a Switch game. Yeah. Damn, well, they actually added a whole bunch of gore. Spider guy. I think it looks pretty good. Well, they're not, they're, it's it's not a very huge developer either. It isn't. No, it isn't. The house of the dead. I want to see more. Okay, thank you. April seventh. Pre-order starts March thirty-first. What? That's a weird thing to announce. Uh, I. You know what? Uh, so it's kind of doing the same thing that Dragoon did, where it's like starts here and then it goes everywhere else. Yeah, it definitely looks different, right? Of all things, it's got it's got a more broody, moody, at moody atmosphere because this was like a Model Two game yeah. of, of, of all things. And I think it just could be this actually feels like it's got funky YouTube compression on it. Like, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling that in some of the action scenes, like the bitrate just feels weirdly low. Like, yeah. right there, it looks nasty as yeah, hell, so, man. Yeah, like, it's got that going on with it. So, I mean, ideally, this this is going to be a Switch exclusive at the start. Yeah, and then, Switch, PC, and, and then, then eventually consoles. it'll come out on PC and, like, other things. Yeah, if it goes the, the Dragoon route, it'll, it'll yeah, it'll be, like, Switch. It's almost then, guaranteed. Yeah, Switch, and then PC, and then other systems. Um, so we're seeing crosshairs, so I wonder, I don't, yeah. They're it's not, hard. And they're not moving very much, right? It's hard to really say, because they didn't show, like... Or say anything about how does the how do the controls work? Is it just you know moving analog sticks, I or is don't. it gyro, or like I yeah? There's like no there's no info. I did not know. Yeah, oh, we're gonna need I'm gonna need like a breakdown. They actually have a release date that's coming out in a month. Um, I need to know more, and I uh, I never have had a chance to fire up Panzer Dragoon after it got fixed on PC. So they they like, fixed the Switch version. Yeah, really. Like, in fact, they even went back. There was there was something really weird because not only did they fix the Switch version after all the uh, the obvious problems. Yeah, they actually did a patch where they lowered the resolution of the game so, so it, the performance markers. so it could go up to sixty. That's good. So they actually did That's that smart. where where they were like, and so you would play the game. Actually, ended up looking like the, the version you would play now doesn't look as good. As the launch version on Switch, on but, Switch it, yeah. but it plays better. That's, plays that's all that matters. So and the PC version was always the one that you could actually run well. Yeah. And I didn't. I bought the PC version, but I didn't like play it. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's such a short game. It's though. a short it's game. Like it's like a thirty-minute game. Yeah. Well, the last one was just a boss battle, I think. Pretty much. I think. It's like, yeah, you do five or six levels, and then it's, then it's there. So then the biggest issue was that is that they had a, a core gameplay element just felt off. Yeah. Like aiming felt weird. A little sluggish. Yeah, it was like sluggish. And yeah, there was a whole bunch of input delay. So, so they fixed that. I'm happy they did fix that, but it was kind of like the. Problem was first first impressions are such a killer. Yeah. 
So. But apparently it sold well. Like apparently I they, hope it, so, man. They, I think they said at some point that it, the sales a bit exceeded their expectations. That's good. Which is good. Because like, you, and, and, and I'd rather they learn, you know, take the take the time to like learn what did and didn't work. Oh yeah. On Panzer Dragoon One. Oh yeah. Because two's a much bigger game. Two's a bigger, more more bold in scope yeah. kind of game. Yeah, and, and then a, they're also doing these, and they're also doing uh, front mission. It? Front mission. Yeah, so. and Panzer Dragoon 2, which they said they're doing, is honestly one of my top 10 games of all time. Mm. I love that game still to this day. Yeah, and, and, and so few people know about Panzer Dragoon, really, and, and, and it's so easy to break up. It's like Star Fox, but a billion times more interesting. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Either way, I think House of the Dead looks okay. Uh, I, I'm not super so highly yet. compressed trailer. Yeah, some of the I, think, parts, I think that's probably like my biggest like you know complaint right now. I'm like, why is this a, compressed to hell? It's a that? very muddy trailer. Uh, either way, I'm gonna play the shit out of it when it comes out and give you some raw impressions. Yeah. But the thing I, I think we still want to know the most is how the hell do you control it? Yeah, unfortunately, it's a minute trail, a minute long trailer, and it doesn't tell doesn't you how to much. control. So it's like. Wait, how does it control though? Because that's, yeah. that's 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 still the next the, big question. That's still the big question on my mind. Like, yep. I think you. I don't know. I don't know if you have any available, but I'm like, I'm imagining you have a Joy-Con, and I imagine it'll kind of just use the gyro, like to point like this and yeah. shoot yeah. off the the R trigger on it. That's kind of what I'm imagining. But they, I haven't heard anything. <laughs> yeah. So. Oh, well, I'm happy. It's we actually finally see something. I'm happy uh, it exists. I hope it's fun, because I think they're supposed to do House of the Dead 2 as well. 